You asked for it, so it's coming back. The Walking Dead All Out War miniatures game first blessed people's gaming tables a little over seven years ago. And after a hugely successful Kickstarter launch, it went on to sell by the truckload into retail. Since we announced its return, it's been so good to see folks breaking out their collections and bringing it back to the table. And I've personally been admiring some of the beautiful setups people have been playing on. Now, the Walking Dead miniatures game will always have a soft spot in my heart. After all, it was the game that got me started on my video making journey. And here I am just over seven years later, telling you that by popular demand, the game is coming back. On Friday, January the 26th, you'll be able to place your pre-orders to either continue your post-apocalyptic stories or to maybe fill out the gaps that you have in your collection. Not only that, but if you're someone who missed out the first time around and you always wanted to get into this fantastic game but just couldn't get your hands on the stuff, well, you'll be pleased to know that we have you covered too with an amazing new collector set to give you everything you need to dive into the world of The Walking Dead. I'll be covering in more detail what you can pre-order in another video next week, but I thought today I'd reminisce a little about my own journey and why The Walking Dead miniatures game has been such a big part of it, and why still to this day do I think it's one of the best miniatures games that's ever been made. I made my first YouTube video on the 2nd of November 2016, and that video was an unboxing of The Walking Dead Wave 1 Kickstarter. I followed that up with a video on how to make a simple scenic board to upgrade the paper mats that came in the box. Afterwards, I made a short playthrough video on how to play, showcasing a couple of turns of the game. And along my journey, I've made videos on how to turn your paper mat into a folding board game style board. I recorded a custom scenario solo gameplay video and even a painting guide on how to get your walkers painted up nice and quickly. All of these videos are still up there to watch now and they're still relevant today. So if you're new to the game, why not check them out? I'll pop a link to a playlist in the description of this video. This game was so accessible to be able to learn how to play. And the fact that you could play it solo meant I could teach myself and then be able to show someone else how to play with me. I used this game to introduce my brother-in-law to miniature gaming as he'd never played a tabletop game in his life. But the fact that the theme was something he had heard of because of the TV show and also because he could play the game cooperatively with me, we were playing together rather than against each other. Of course, once he very quickly got the hang of it, we were battling it out against each other across the tabletop and those walkers being controlled by the elegant game mechanics became a threat to both of us but also, if used correctly, a weapon we could direct towards each other. The compelling scenarios and the tactical depth of the game made us want to go and play the game with other folks, and so we went to a Walking Dead event together. And here is where I came across one of the most friendly, encouraging, and supportive communities I had ever met. And I'd played other miniatures games at events and tournaments previously too, so this isn't necessarily what I was expecting. I came to realise that this wasn't just limited to the Walking Dead community, but that it seemed to spill out into the wider Mantic community too. And this is where my love of Mantic's games and the Mantic community truly began. So why the self-indulgent trip down memory lane? Well, because if it wasn't for the Walking Dead miniatures game, I may not be sitting here today working for Mantic Games. And if it wasn't for the amazing Mantic community, I might not be sitting here excitedly telling you that the Walking Dead is coming back. If you're someone who can't wait to get your hands on the new stuff, then I don't really need to tell you how great this game is. But if you're someone on the edge of this, wondering if you should jump in, then make sure to subscribe to the Mantic YouTube channel and I'll soon be telling you all the amazing things that you can get your hands on to start your very own Walking Dead journey.